Hi guys, so today's video is going to be the second video in my Disney travel series which is a what is in my carry-on bag. Just before I forget, next week there will be no videos as I am away next week but do not worry because the week after that there will be five Disney vlogs up for you to watch which I am very excited about. Yeah, today's video I'm going to be showing you what I am taking in my carry-on bag. Me and Connor are travelling via coach. A coach treats us up, we drive all the way down to the Channel Tunnel, we go under the Channel Tunnel, we end up in France, and then the coach drives us to Disney. So, just so you're aware, that is how we are travelling. We are allowed one travel piece. So, I picked practically the biggest bag I could find. I got this bag for my birthday. It is so heavy. I got this bag for my birthday. It is a huge Victoria's Secret tote bag. It has a little multicoloured tassel on the front it's just black um a faux leather but this is huge so seeing as we are only allowed one piece of hand luggage this situates all my hand luggage and also my handbag so i'm going to start with my handbag which is just in here which i'm just going to pull out which is going to be for my disney trip my michael kors backpack this is the rear zip backpack and this is the color bisque in case any of you are wondering on all my other videos where i've showed my kors bags i have had questions but yeah this is the bag i'm going to be taking with me it's a backpack so that is sort of what i was wanting for disney something that could just hold everything and me not have to worry about this is actually quite heavy but when it is on my back it's it's not too bad it's like the cute backpack so i didn't have to get a big one so yeah so anyway this has a couple of compartments this front zip compartment has nothing in it but this front little zip compartment, if I open it up, has this in it, which is like a document holder. Now this holds everything that we need. So in here I have all the tickets, the documents, my passport, which has a cute Jack Wills passport holder on it. Connor's passport will be in here when he gives me it put in here but all the documents that we get go in here so that they don't get lost and that we make sure we have everything we need the insurance everything like that in here which slots nicely in the front pocket of the bag moving on to the big main pocket this is the only other pocket in the bag and it is quite a large bag it just doesn't open very far um so i don't know if you can see in there there's a little pocket there and there's two little pockets on the side and a little zip bit. Um, in the zip bit there is just tampons and pads, just in case of any situations. Well, I'm there, obviously a necessity. It also has one of these um, attachments, which just has my house keys on it, because I'm not gonna be taking my car keys, because I'm obviously not driving my car, so I'm leaving my car here. Um, but yeah, it has my house keys on it, which have a ridiculous amount of key rings on them. I only actually have two keys on here. I have a key for my house and a key for Connor's house. So, yep, that is the first thing. So in the big pocket, I have my sunglasses. So these are just the Key Australia sunglasses. You'll have seen these in my videos last year if you watched. These are the Cherry Bomb sunglasses. I got these off ASOS. I'm not sure if they are, will still be on there. But yeah, they're just sort of rose gold mirrored sunglasses. Just in case it's sunny. I know we are going in March, but it can get a little bit sunny and any excuse to wear my sunglasses so in the other two side pockets all i have is packs of tissues because i do have a little bit of a cold at the minute so i want to take tissues with me for the obvious reason that you would take tissues moving on from the tissue conversation um right everything in here now is just randomly in no order so i have my tangle teaser obviously hairbrush i have my purse this is just a michael kors purse this is great because it has loads of i'll come my idea it has loads of compartments so i can sort of s separate my english money and my thing a minute it also has lots of card slots covering my id up um so any room keys and bits and bobs can go in there this is just the only purse that i use so taking that i also have my michael kors travel pouch Thing. This holds all my tablets. I have a massive situation with headaches and belly aches and cuts and sore throats and bits and bobs. So 
I have a lot of tablets in here. So I have sort of headache tablets, paracetamol, travel sickness tablets. I have my prescription headache tablets. I have, what are they? Paracetamol, strepsils. All in this. So if any of us get ill while we're away, plenty of tablets in there for that. Um, then I have a little deodorant. This is the Dove Go Fresh. It's the compressed ones, the small ones. Just, just a deodorant, really. I have some chewing gum. This is just the extra spearmint, the big, big pot. We've got that for if after we've eaten, we want fresh breath. And the last thing in here is the perfume that I'm taking, which is the Lo de Rose Eau de Parfum. Got this for my birthday, but it's just a lovely small size bottle. Um, so it can just stay in my handbag. It smells really nice. So just taking that as my perfume while I'm there. So that is the contents of my backpack. When we get there, I will obviously have phone and phone chargers in here. But for now, we will move on to my actual hand luggage bag. Right, so moving on to the hand luggage bag, there's not actually that much stuff in here because most of it is in most of it is in my handbag, but I will just go through what is in here. So the first thing is a blanket. Now this might seem quite stupid to take a blanket. This one is just from Primark. Um oh it's unrolling. It's just grey, sort of like a fleecy blanket with owls on it. But on the way there. We are travelling for about 12 hours, getting there and getting back. And the way back is all overnight. So this will be multi-purpose. If it's cold, if I need it while we're in the hotel at Disney, if it can be used as a pillow, can put my head on it, cover me up for when I'm going to sleep. It's just going to make it easier. And when it's rolled up like this, it doesn't really take too much space up and... Yeah, so I am 19 years old taking a blanket with me, but it's just going to make the trip more comfortable. Next thing in here is my iPad. I have a Jack Wills um, case on this. It's one of the cases that has a stand. It's quite a padded one as well, so it's good in case it's getting bashed about. It has the little stands. I have the iPad. I have no idea which iPad it is. It hasn't got a fingerprint. I've had it since about 2012, so it's quite an old one, but it still works perfectly fine. Um, I don't know if it says on here which one it is. No. This iPad. And it's white and silver. Yes. But this will come in useful for watching Netflix or listening to music. We have Wi-Fi on the bus. So if I wanted to mess up my phone, I could put Netflix on here. Or I could put a film on. Oh, that's Netflix. Or I could put some music on. So yeah, I'm just taking my iPad. Probably won't use it all that much, but I'm taking it anyway. The next thing in here is my headphones. So I have Beats. I have two pairs of headphones in here though. So I've taken a pair of in-ears because if I want to put music on or a film on and go to sleep, sleeping in over the head headphones is not what I'm about. So these are just the I Love. I don't even know what they are. They're just Apple I Love um, headphones. They are pink. And the other ones that have the squidgy in ear things because I can't stand ones that don't have these squidgy earbud bits so I have those ones and then I also have my Beats these are the um they're hot pink they're the Solo I've had these for a good few years now um they're just headphones noise cancelling headphones so I can watch a film in peace on the thing. And I also, in this little Beats pouch, I have some of the earbuds for the other headphones in case I lose one and need some more. So yeah, just headphones. I then have this little pouch, which came with the bag. It's another Victoria's Secret pouch. It's all multicolored sequins. And this houses all of my charges and electrical bits and bobs. 
so in here i have this charger which is for my portable charger which is also here this is the juice power station go this charges your phone five times um so always always need this so that's the charger for that and then have my phone charger which will also charge my ipad so that is gonna be charging my ipad and then i have my hard drive because connor is taking his laptop for me to move the vlogs to so i'm gonna bob them on my hard drive so this is just a really just a sonics hard drive a really big gig hard drive and then this is the little plug to plug it into the laptop just so all of my vlogs and anything that i video while i'm there are safe on this is all that is in there for now the only other thing that may end up in there is we may take some snacks which probably will end up in connor's hand luggage because he will have less things in it i'm also considering taking a little hoodie with me i'm gonna have my scarf on so that's like a big blanket scarf so that will be probably end up in the bag when i'm on the couch and i may just take a little hoodie with me just in case it gets cold even though i have the blanket but yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed this video just showing you what is in my bag that i am taking to disney so i am very very excited to go i will see you all when i am back check my instagram because i will definitely be posting loads and loads and loads of pictures on there for you all to see and yeah give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on my disney vlogs and i will see you on my next video bye